Hello everybody. Thank you so much for joining me. My name is Haley with Haley's Designer Wigs in Mesa, Arizona. Um, I haven't been doing a lot of reviews lately. I've been so busy here in the store where, I mean, wigs are just so popular right now that it's just been really crazy. So I apologize that I haven't been making tons of review videos for you all. Um, but recently I've sold so many of these Mila's and then I got one for myself and I'm like, holy moly, this is an incredible wig. I am so happy with this wig. I'm so impressed and um, felt compelled to share this one with you guys because it's one of my favorites that I've had in a really, really long time. So the Mila is um, one of John Renault's best-selling curly styles. It's mid-length. It does come in both average and petite sizes. And then it comes in a whopping 35 color choices. So this one, they're um, making it in all the color choices. That just goes to show how good of a seller it is and how popular and versatile that the Mila has been for the company. Um, recently, it came out in the four new California Blonde colors and it also comes in the four chocolate collection colors so you've got pretty much every color that John Renault is currently um, producing on their newer styles uh, made in this Mila. Uh, mine is the FS 17 101 S18 so what that's going to mean is a um, light beige ashy toned low light you see some pieces there and then you've got quite a bit of that 101 color. And the 101 is just a nice pale platinum. It doesn't have a hint of gold at all. It's your light, ashy, pale, um, super blonde platinum color. And then the root is a very light color. So 18, that's going to be a light, um, ashy shading. It's really not a deep root at all because I know that a lot of women, once you have grayer hair, you know, the type of people that are kind of looking for this blonde a lot of the times have a lighter, grayer hair. They don't have brown hair anymore. Their hair has transitioned into a lighter color. So to wear a really deep root really doesn't um, make sense and look right on the face. But with this type of root, it really does um, show through nicely. It looks appropriate. It's believable. Uh, they nailed it. Basically, they nailed it on this color. And then, of course, the FS is going to be one of their fashion syrup colors. So you've got um, more pronounced foils um, throughout this one. So you do have defined pieces of the color 17 and defined pieces of the color 101. All right. So the um, Mila is a single mono scalp and a lace front. So, of course, the lace front is wonderful. The smart lace is durable. It allows for off-the-face styling. There's a lot of things you can do with a lace front wig you know you can pin it pin it up pin it back whatever whatever have you you can style this one how you want and wear it really confidently and just feel good and confident that nobody's gonna know it's a wig unless you decide to tell them and then um, the single mono i'll just show you guys that up close so single monofilament is going to be your most breathable mono top you can see right through this one it's you know it's super uh, sheer breathable blow through it the air transfers really really well so the single mono is nice. Um, a lot of brands are making, you know, comfort type of caps where they put like a chiffon or some type of fabric lining um, in the mono. I pref um, I do not prefer that. It's warm where I live. I like a single mono scalp where the air can escape right off my head and um, I feel comfortable and cool and um, I feel, you know, chill all day. So I'm gonna let you guys know that the um, Mila is only 3.8 ounces in weight. It's light, it's bouncy, the hair has good movement, um, it's playful and fun. There's just a little bit more length up here in the front. Almost like I see like a touch of an asymmetrical thing going on, but I don't think that's purposeful. It's just part of the playful style. I'll turn to the side so you guys can see that it's a little bit shorter up front, up top, and then it gets subtly, subtly longer. I'll show you the back. So what a wearable length. Um, absolutely anybody can get away with this length as long as you desire to do so. This is totally wearable and I would put anybody into um, this wig because it's youthful and playful um, but not screaming like, I'm trying to be 17 again. So that's not what we're trying to do. We're trying to look like stylish, fashionable women and this wig um, hits the mark on that. Um, as far as the measurements go, we've got an 11 inch bang. I guess it's still called a bang even if it's not cut into a bang. But 11 inches in the front and then from the crown on down we've got 13 inches of hair. Um, 7 inch nape. 
but it is curly so you got a lot of movement in that nape so it's it's long but also you can like move it around and then um, 10 inches on the sides. So those are the measurements just very like much so a mid-length easy to wear length. And um, if you guys want to know more about this wig, this is one of my all-time favorites. It's becoming that anyways. I've been getting so many compliments, you guys. Um, I went just to the grocery store yesterday, and the cashier called me a supermodel, which was like kind of funny to me, but it was because of the wig. I was rocking this wig, and she noticed how good it looked. And then um, this morning in the parking lot, um, one of the neighboring business owners stopped me and said, I absolutely love that color on you. I love that lighter blonde. Um, and I just love the way that your hair looks. So I'm like, okay, cool. She totally noticed and took the time to walk over to me and mention the hair. So I guess this is a statement piece. I'm uh, feeling good about the Mila wig. If you guys need to order one of these, please give me a call, 480-307-9466. Um, I offer amazing pricing. Don't be afraid to ask. And I can guide you through colors as well. So I look forward to speaking with you about this cute wig. And have an awesome day, you guys. Have a beautiful hair day.